Did you know? Weekly tips from your support team. Sometimes you need to cut out the contour from a measurement surface so it doesn't show any results there. How can you do that? Go to the floor plan view and select the tool Add new virtual measuring area. Then position and adjust the size of this measurement surface according to the area of the cutout needed. If you have cutout forms, which are round or custom, you may use the Draw a Virtual Measuring Surface tool. If you have multiple gaps, then you may create as many of these surfaces as required. Once you've created and adjusted the cutout surfaces, select the main measurement surface that the cutout form should be removed from. In the following dialog, you will see that the cutout contour was not found. This is because the cutout form does not have the same height as the main surface. So, we adjust the height of the cutout surface the same as the main one and switch to the 3D view before enabling the cutout contour dialog. Now we can see that the cutout surface is displayed, which we can select and transfer it to the contours in use box. If your cutout contour was originally drawn a bit too small or you want to make it bigger, smaller, you may adjust it by using Scale Up or Down option, or even delete it. After that, recalculate, and you will see that this gap is not taken into account for the results of the measurement surface. If you wish to get informed regarding new tutorials and features in Redux Pro, please subscribe to our newsletter and also follow our social media channels. Thank you for watching.